Give them the, uh, the recognition that they deserve. Uh, so, Mr. Roth, if you will, talk to us a little bit about uh, you know, what's to come, what are some things that uh, we have to look forward to. Well, we're, we're, we're super excited about the finished product, and so far everybody that's seen it, it's, it's just been rave reviews. Stunning, beautiful, awesome, incredible. Um, the kids that have come in have absolutely loved it. Patrons that have came in um, have, have loved it. Um, and uh, on, on, on my part, I really want to thank the students um, for, like Mr. Riffle said, 16 weeks is a long time to be out of your classroom, because essentially that's what this is. It's a classroom. And for our P students to be displaced for those 16 weeks, um, especially once the weather finally, you know, the weather hasn't been good, and you know they were they were stuck in here, and but they didn't have the gym. All they had were the decks. So I really want to thank them um, for all that they did, and and a and a, a big thank you. And I can't express uh, thanks enough to my staff, um, Gail Perry, Ron Brown, Rodney Unis, our three PE teachers we have here, and. They, they did a phenomenal job keeping the kids engaged, keeping the kids as active as they could um, with what limited resources that we had. Um, you know, when we were tearing up the floor, there was all kinds of dust and dirt and debris, and there were some days where it was too bad. The kids couldn't even be in the gym. And they came up with other activities for the kids um, to, to stay busy. So, like I said, I, I can't express enough thanks um, to them throughout this whole process. Um, our, our maintenance uh, department, Bruce Gephardt, um, and, and, and all the guys we have working here in the building from the time that the pipes burst and, and the floodwaters hit the gym, you know, they were here before six o'clock in the morning, you know, taking care of the problem and they've continued to do so through, um, throughout the process. So, like I said, I can't thank enough people for everything that they've done through this whole process. And, and here again, th thanks, thank yous, and all the thank yous in the world aren't going to show just truly how much we appreciate um, everything that everybody's done. Members of the community, our patrons that came to games, they had to travel to Plymouth for our home games. 
um, yeah, it, it's been a rough 16 weeks. It hasn't been, hasn't always been fun, but like I said, in the end, uh, our kids, again, I can't say enough great things about them, what, of what they've endured.